for sit here and call for Ben Four. I've never gone uh, with the, the crew, but I don't know. I'm here late. Usually I'd be gone by now because the setups are down. But I mean, I'm here, so <laughs> I'm down. I guess I'm staying. Yeah. Might as well get a grab a burger before I go home. Alrighty, grand finales. Got the Zelda. We got the Rob. Again, Machu not messing around. He went to Rob in game three when we saw that set uh, in winner's finals between the two of them. Didn't work out though, though. Fear is able to take that game. And now here they are at the end of all things. Machu, though, looking strong here at the start of game one. So I think with this matchup, of course, you got a couple characters, zoners, yeah. mostly, so. These are two characters that can zone and also go in at the same time. Yeah, it's true. I think on PS2, it would be surprising to see them both sort of back up and each take a platform for their own. That's uppy there, sort of extended the hitbox, but I'm well, not able to capitalize. To yeah, that was nice with the gyro there placed right at ledge. It's so dangerous. That trap that you just have there. Always have to think about it, make sure you're not going to get caught by it. Nair into up tilt, into up air. Machu looks like he's carrying that momentum that he got in that set against EPO right into this one against Furez. And already up here, a full stock. Oh, there we go. Nehru's love. See if that shifts momentum. Yeah. Oh, here oh, they no. come. Here they come. <laughs> no kill on Ooh, face. the reversal. Yeah. <laughs> Furious is just waiting there, like, yeah, send me across stage, bro. It's fine. <laughs> <laughs> this is all good. So, definitely a lead here, so far, Machu, but on the same stocks, if Zelda's able to get one cheeky, that back air, so scary a ledge, but nice drift from Furious. Able to get out of it. And too long on the ledge hang there when you're over 100%. Doesn't last nearly as long as you might think. No, it's very quick. And getting I, some gyro setups into just up e. Yeah, Fura's difficulty getting in, I would say, you know, Nacho using the gyro really, really well, following it up with the Nair as well, which is such a hard move to fight your way in against. But he's able to just stand there sometimes and wait for the Zelda to come to him and, you know, fend her off each and every time. And this one, I mean, all of a sudden, Fura's on his last stock, very close to dying. Up smash would take this, a side B off stage would take this, that town smash would have taken it. Using the phantom there and it gets caught by the gyro, which is coming down to meet him. It get caught there. Nice job by Machu, knowing to shield those strong Zelda aerials. And this is, I mean, this is night and day compared to what we saw in Winner's Finals. Uh, he was playing a different character for a lot of it, but he just looks so dialed in, does Machu. Yeah. Goes for the up throw and off the platform. Yeah. So yeah, great first game for him. Machu needs to win six, of course. Sure is coming from the winner's side, but uh, if he keeps it up like he did there, it could be six quick games. But of course, Fear is he's going to have a game plan here. He'll be able to adapt in some sense. Yeah. Yeah. And see if he can fight back against this nasty, nasty Rob. The thing about Rob, of course, big character, right? That's if true. you're playing, that, that's like the big weakness for Rob. Exactly, Rob is big. You've heard it a hundred times. <laughs> I think with lots of characters, that's great. But with Zelda, where you know she has confirms, but she doesn't have too many combos, especially yeah, a low percent, right? So you know, you, even if you hit, uh, like yeah, her aerials are going to be a little bit easier to hit, but you're not getting that mileage off of it, and so it can be difficult for Zelda to really rack up the percent, especially. Uh, Machu, of course, really good at spacing the moves that he's using. Uh, and again, just sort of parrying everything or, or fending off everything that's coming his way. He loves going for that down air. Gyro extending the hitbox to the Phantom. That was an interesting interaction. I thought Machu might have been caught by that. There come the fares and the down tilts. Air and land. Machu's advantage. And the back air there catches the drift back into stage. Just some solid neutral we saw there. Yeah. Yeah, Machu just feels like he's playing, you know, like ten minutes ahead or something like that. Like he's just, he's just slightly on everything ready. Oh, there's the there's yeah. a lead with a jump. No, oh, that was a really nice. Too soon on this one. Yeah, and it's dead even. Yeah. 
you know, this is great. And of course, Rob is going to come at you there. <laughs> He's just throwing his arms at you. He just wants a hug, bro. <laughs> Roll behind into up tilt and there, and I mean that's that's about all Zelda can get, right? In terms of strings, there just aren't that many different flow charts that she can go down, and yeah, so it's tough. But again, Furious putting up a really good fight in this one, dropping down the gyro. I mean, maybe it'll catch Furious as he's trying to recover, but the intangibility of the teleport is nice for getting around the gyro. Tries to pick it up there, but Furious unsuccessful. Get off ledge against Rob, which is a, <laughs> is a triumph. <laughs> Congratulations. <laughs> give, give him the money now. You see it, uh, it's all in this situation. It's just like, it, it's tough. What is Nanshu gonna do? Yeah, catches with the Nair. They're not gonna kill. I wonder if he's going to be able to... Being patient, eventually getting that kill from yeah. the ledge trap. You know, he's throwing out all of these projectiles when Furious is off stage. And every time Furious, understandably, is throwing out the neutral B, trying to reflect them back, and I wonder if Machu is going to try and pick up on that. Maybe be a bit more aggressive with edge guarding and just say, okay, you want to reflect my projectile? Let me call you out on that. Hit you with a side B. There are lots of options. Ooh. Catches the Phantom. Gyro combos. God, this is just. Ooh, tried to end it all, and for his troubles, he will catch a down air, yeah. yeah. The, the down air to strong aerial it seems to be a very consistent, good combo. Yeah, the strong aerial to strong arrow, you might say. Yeah. God, those moves do a lot of damage. <laughs> the Phantom out here playing golf with the gyro. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> And uh, Phantom has 105 yards into this part five, and what a beautiful Down strike. Down into strong hit back air. <laughs> I knew which one that was. <laughs> <laughs> Very good. That gets a golf clap from me in honor of the Phantom, picking that one up. <laughs> so yeah, nice work by there. Nice work there by Furus. Gotta work on my syntax a little bit. And now only two games away. Just needs yeah. to get the single set in grand finals as he did get the win in winner's finals. And, you know, I felt like in that one, Macho was playing really, really well, but Fura is able to pick his spots. I, I was quite impressed and talked about the fact that he Zelda doesn't have that combo opportunity that other characters do, but chipped away. Yes. Really good at, you know, taking it one step at a time. And also Fura has got a lot on, on his openings whenever, uh, like... There was an opportunity to get something into a strong hit. Yeah. He oh, got it and it killed. He's so good at those confirms all the time. So we're into game three here. Town and city. So lots of space for both of these characters. And of course these platforms here, it's very dangerous. If you're getting hit by somebody up there, anything could kill. But the stage might favor Zelda a little bit more. Yeah. But uh, stage is just one factor in the game. Oh, 100%. <laughs> it's big so she can run away, but she's not obviously all that fast. So we're well, trying to get the jump read there. Doesn't come across, but does. Yeah, I'll smash out of shield. Scoops! <laughs> And now Machu in firm control of this one, almost up to full stock already. Ooh, that air dodge there, a bit presumptive. Machu able to catch that. Here come those gyros. Not able to Machu turn into a combo. Those gyro combos. Yeah. Gyro right up the ledge, can't yeah. do much to get around that. It's tough. Such a tough zone. I, Look I feel like Rob has one of the best ledge traps in the entire game, if not number one, so this is very tough. Yeah, it is really good. Oh, just grabs right through the Phantom. <laughs> yeah, he's over there playing golf. I'm just going to take you over here <laughs> behind the ninth green while he's having his fun. Ooh. Yeah. Very so well done. It's a risky move, but it worked out. <laughs> Try to pick up yeah, the gyro. Yeah, the three oh. jabs there to try to pick I, up the gyro. I, I feel it. Yeah, it's a tough spot now. Three stocks to one here. <laughs> I like Machu picking up that gyro while he was falling. It was very oh, slick, oh. and uh, yeah, that'll kill from anywhere. <laughs> yeah. Which area? Which area was it, Mercer? You tell me. Uh, I was not paying attention. <laughs> uh, back here. That's the final question, who wants to be a millionaire? Dude, 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 with the neighbors left there, able to poke around the shield a little bit. Mamachu landing on top of the Phantom. 
Ooh, nice catch on the gyro there. He drops it. Drops it yeah. yeah, it doesn't get much out of it. Nor does Furious get much out of it. That was tilt. a big forward smash for you to not yeah. connect, but the air dodge happened, but the drift was, was not what Mosh was looking for. Yeah, that would have been something. And that one, that was back air, that right? That was back air. Yeah, yes. okay, I'm learning. I'm learning. Old dog, new tricks. It can happen. So, you know, doable for Furious here. Ooh, the, goes for the down smash to end it all. Ooh, this is Ooh almost got the reset the on the platform. Throw. And just the last hit the up air is not going to kill. On the platforms, leave. Those platforms can be so dicey at this point in the match. Machu, of course, not really in much danger of dying, but for Furious, the down throw. Wow, that was a nice mash. Interesting how Gyro doesn't like really reflect off of Zelda's reflector. It just sort of stops and falls. Yeah, that's strange. I never, I didn't really think about that. Yeah. I, this might be a, uh, the game. Yes. Uh. <laughs> nice job by Machu there, taking uh, game three. I, I saw the uh, the good attempts to DI, but it was not enough. Yeah, it looked like almost there, but you no, know, Machu is able to take that one as we move to two one, one game away from the bracket reset here. Uh, and I mean, I'm enjoying this matchup a lot, so I would not be opposed to that. Uh, I'd say I'm, I'm having a good time, first time commentating. Yeah, you're doing a pretty good job of it. <laughs> your voice starting to get tired, right? Uh, no, I, you know, voice is fine. Oh, that's is your, good. Is your voice tired? My voice I mean, is always I mean, tired, man. You're, you're, the, you're the primary, I, I just play off of what you say, you know? <laughs> I'm play by play your color, <laughs> yeah. you know? <laughs> so hard to do proper play-by-play -play for Smash. Everything is happening so quickly. For sure. <laughs> Jab, up B, down B, Nair, dash attack, forward air. <laughs> it's like, it's not really that interesting. <laughs> Those Nairs coming out from Rob, definitely just such a good move. So much coverage with it. And so difficult to fight through. And there, see, in that instance, the, the neutral B is reflecting the gyro and pushing it back. So maybe oh, it's no, grounded. No tech, but it is Rob. It's Rob. And Oh, fake's going to the other side of Smashville, <laughs> yeah. but says, no, actually, this is fine. I I'll do this. He misses the tech and then goes for, like, back airs and stuff. You know, that's just, that's just the recovery. Yeah, 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 yep. <laughs> is it fair? I don't know. <laughs> oh, I don't know, yeah. Oh, didn't go I'll, for I'll the upbeat. Ultimate's remarkably balanced, but there might be a couple things in there that, you know, maybe we should be adjusting. Nice uh, job with that fair there to come back. Something I've noticed in Furious's game plan, you know, he loves going for those upbeat Zelda's in general. Love that move, right? Yeah. And the way it can kill. But often he's not pulling the trigger and, you know, sending it up and trying to get those kills because he knows that if he messes it up, if Machu DI is out of it, getting juggled by Rob is such a bad place to be. So he is gonna get a kill with a back wow. throw there. Yeah. Okay. And air dodging through that up there, that was very important. Down throw I think. Oh no, to end the stock click and there it is. Yeah. Up throw without a platform, they're still killing him. We're 0 0 now, second stock. Of course, for Machu, he is coming from loser side, so looking for that reset. Gonna get a slight hit on Nehru's left there. Oh, wow, Machu using that platform for the extension, but Fur is able to fight his way out, and now, now it's his combo. Gets the weak hit of the aerial, though. Wouldn't have killed, but wanted that extra percent. Yeah, could have led to something else. Nair to come through. And again, it, another use for that move for Rob is just fighting your way off of ledge. Just jump in there. Yeah. Right? And it's like, well, what do you do? <laughs> you cannot keep ledge trapping from there. And that time, he does pull the trickery, but great guy there from Machu, not dying. Even from the platform there, I thought he was gone, but... Oh, nice call out with the down smash. You miss your text. And that's your punishment. Nair. The oh, speed. Some gyro combo there, but yeah. the down air. Oh. I love makes it back to uh, on stage. Yeah, I love how quickly he's able to throw out aerial, repatch the gyro. Like it's just, it's so it's so fast, it's so refined. How he's able to get the gyro so quickly back in his hand, uh, z dropping it or throwing it out. Reflect on the gyro there. Yeah, maybe it's grounded neutral B for Zelda reflects it, or maybe it's the time in the move that it hits. Ooh, got the air dodge there, but not able to connect. Oh, the deep side B takes the game. That. And we're seeing a bracket reset. Yeah, really good play there by Machu. And again, and again that's what I talked about, you know, sometimes when he was on stage, a lot of time when he was on stage, in fact, 
throwing out the projectiles, playing it very safe. He's saying, you know, I'll go for a ledge trap here, you know, and then in that moment there to reset the back, uh, reset the bracket rather, goes all the way out, goes for the edge guard. You're wrong. What's the worst that's going to happen? <laughs> yeah. But now, 0-0, zero, zero, game one all over again. Went back in time pretty much. <laughs> yeah. We'll see what kind of adjustments can be made. Furus is, you know, getting bodied, not in the sense of, like, getting beaten badly, but, like, the brawling is definitely in Rob's favor. Yeah. And she's sort of getting getting sent from point A to point B a lot in this set, so... Zelda kind of only has, like, one answer for, for like, a get-up option, and it's that move. Yes. Uh, but if that move doesn't work, then you're in for, uh, uh, something. You're in for a tough time. Yeah. 100%. This is good here. Able to get that up tilt connecting into the back air. Phantom is out, and so Machu says, I will take to the skies. Does not want anything to do with that up air there. Not gonna kill. Here's air touching back there. Has the gyro in hand, and Machu going up for it again, but now reversing the edge guard. Nice tech. That was a good attack. I'm surprised that was techable, because that was the strong hand. Yeah. It's not quite at that percent, but. Good work by Machu to keep this first stock. And this one nice, even Stevens. Do we got enough to throw? We do. Machu really good at finding those grabs underneath the platform. Because of course that makes the up throw kill much, much earlier. Really nice work from him as the backer connects. You got a bunch of jet fuel in your face. It can't feel fun. No, never <laughs> do you know from experience, by uh, chance? Maybe. <laughs> We'll need to get a story time from Mercer later on yeah, to hear about yeah, that. I, 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 I'll, I'll say, yeah, no, it didn't happen. <laughs> oh, back air there, not going to connect. Machu doing a good job of holding on to this stock. He's not getting hit by any of those brutal Zelda aerials anytime soon. There's nice. no reflect on the gyro that time. Yeah, I think so, it did reflect. It just didn't go anywhere. Yeah, and, and it might be like the specific hit of the neutral. Yeah. Some of them reflect it back and other ones stop it in its tracks. Yeah, up throw there, finally going to get the kill, but Machu right back to business already. is going to take an upbeat, but that's only 13% and still the game greatly in Machu's favor. Down throw here. What's the follow? Does get the drift back forward air. Goes for the side smash. Trying to just, ooh, up smash not gonna scoop yeah, there. Scoop that time. He was hanging on. I, I, I feel like I've seen up smash uh, scoop from farther away, so I don't know what happened. <laughs> nice air dodge there, just barely staying alive, and gets the kill sparks and the kill yeah. with that forward air, and all of a sudden, Kura's in the lead here. Drop down there, a little bit of percent of raw dash attack, sure. Now getting up off the ledge. The down smash comes out so quickly, but able to avoid it. And nice the up patience. Air. Yeah. yeah. The short hop. I knew exactly when Zelda was going to pop out. The mind games around that are always so interesting because you de delay your mash, right? Yeah. And try and mess them up. For... And here come those gyro combos into the nair. Oh, that phantom connecting. But again, there's that move that gets you back on stage. That back here not gonna connect, or will connect, but not gonna kill. Phantom guarding the edge, but Machu patient, able to get back up, and now we're seeing more of these aerials from Zelda connect. And there's another one. Just like that one, and in the grand final reset, Furious takes the first game and establishing himself there. Really good work spacing his moves, finding a way to connect all those back airs, forward airs, up airs, down airs, everything but Nair is one of those big chunky moves yeah, that's in her sure. kit, so really great work. So game two here, no character switches. We're not, no, uh, not I, I, at this point. I think that the characters are set in stone. And again, we have Town and City. I guess you know, closer horizontal blast zones for Rob side beat. Useful. Yeah, it's like um, uh, with a such a long Ooh. stage. Ooh, wow! Oh, that's that's the down air yeah. and. 13 seconds in. With such a long stage, it makes gyro a bit less effective for setting up traps, it's but true. those down tilt strings can go a long way. Yeah. Machu, after losing that first game of the reset, looks, you know, ready to tie this one up and do it quickly. That but was that nice aerial. Combo. The platform went away, but. 
made it, maybe could have been a combo session there, but the platform left. Yeah, that trade that we saw there with both forward dares coming out. Phantom and <laughs> guarding roll at least. Up there. Pretty much a full set lead. Oh, guess the downer again. There's not the sweet spot. spot. And there's the sweet spot. Man, he's nailing that timing now. That's got to be scary if you're Furious. Three stocks to one here. I'm actually showing no signs of slowing down. You watch Fast and Furious? Have you seen those movies? Uh, a few of them, yeah. You know the NOS? Like no. that, that like extra special fuel that they can put in their cars. Oh, actually, no, I do, yeah. Yeah, yeah. 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 Uh, so nitro. Rob here Plus. has put the NOS I into see. his jet boosters. Yeah. So he's just... And, the, and they're going to have, in case of the first movie, they're going to have all those like cheesy 2000s effects on the screen right now. Oh, 100%. Put them on the stream. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, I would say Zelda's wearing a bit too much clothing oh, no. to be in a Missed Fast and Furious there. movie. And yeah, that's uh, that was a quick game. Yeah. So after Furious, you know, got that nice win in game one, Matru said, okay, that's cute. <laughs> uh, I love that for you, but, you know, we're going to tie this one back. Yeah. So back to Battlefield for game three. It's funny, I haven't looked around. There's, this room is so empty now. <laughs> <laughs> Our whole world torn down around yeah. us. I've, I've been hyper-focused on this monitor for so long, my, like, my brain's going to go to mush. Yeah. But hey, almost at the end of the road here. Maximum three games left, and hopefully we get more of this high-quality gameplay that we've seen up to this point. Both of these two fighting for their lives, fighting to try and win Stitch Face number three. Machu, uh, Machu, of course, this is his first appearance at the event. Did not come Russian to the first two. Be his first win. Yeah. Moral oh. Cures come through. Exactly. Nice snare there, Still turning into right now. a couple of fairs. Zelda fighting back with that nair, getting on stage. Oh, that gyro almost hit her. Going to let in something for Rob, but able to pick it up. Phantom, weak Phantom coming out, but the gyro gets through it, hits her out of it. Oh, <laughs> air dodge back to grab the gyro there, not able to get much out of it, but solid and drifting back. Nicely done by Machu there to get that hit still on the side B. Definitely kill percent for us here. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah that was like a middle of B, but doesn't lead to a kill. No, that's the danger with it though. Oh, went for the down yeah. smash there to end Oh, and that will not kill. Also not must be sale or DI, you know? Yeah. Many factors to consider. Air dodges through that gyro, but gets oh, well, hit. Well, was, oh, yeah. Has her jump, but Oh, but still did. wasn't enough. Yeah. I think it might have been enough. I think the angles just got slightly wonky there. Zelda not able to get back. Machu taking the first stock here. Oh, another yeah. super committal up B. Gets That's punished. Thing. Machu... Ooh, Ooh uh, hit the downer the there, just sour a down. Hit. Yeah. yeah, but the side smash there, that's gonna kill no matter what hit you get with it. Very strong move. <laughs> Fierce just yeeting that gyro up into the sky. Get that out of here! <laughs> <laughs> we fight like men! <laughs> Says the woman to the robot. <laughs> but, <Yes>. <laughs> Here comes an up air, Zelda up in the air. Oh, oh legend! The timing on that down Zumatu air. was ready. You just lose the stock just like that with that move. Oh, across the stage gyro combo. Just patience there on the ledge for Furas. Understands that this game, you know, if you can pile some sort of damage up, definitely not out of reach. Goes for up tilt, up tilt. Ooh, speaking of up tilts, there's one from Rob into the up air, and that would have done it there, but very clutch air dodge coming through Furas. He's got his fingernails over the cliff's edge right now. This is a tough spot to be in. And a scoop. Another game. And you look at Machu there, you know, on his second stock, only at 46%. I mean, that was... We have a potential last game for the yeah. entire tournament coming up, but... Yep. Not if Fierce has anything to say about it. Definitely not, yeah. Definitely, it was convincing from Machu what we just saw there, but this one is not over. Furious again, no question on the character choice. Sticking with this one. I don't think we're seeing any mix-ups for the characters anymore. No. 
So could this be the last game that we see of Stitch Face number three? As you mentioned, Furious does not want that to happen, but there's a possibility here on his last breath as he gets to game four. <laughs> Just nair after nair after nair. See this jump here? Save the jump. He does, and he gets it back. back. Okay. Drifts back to make sure a not get hit by Ron. Yeah. That was really good job getting the angle right on the up B. That looked like it was right at the upper extent of what Zelda could do. Yeah, for sure. That made it work. I said Nair through the gyro, and that just not gonna work. That gyro, that spinning top, always gonna come through. It's like a Beyblade out there. Both these characters are pretty good at spinning. <laughs> it's true. <laughs> Ooh, able to catch. I feel like I've seen that set up for that ledge cap yeah, all the time. The, the gyro is extending the hitbox on the getup attack and just making him sit there like a sitting duck for longer. And, and Machu capitalizing with that back air. We'll try to go that side. Not able to connect to that down air is Zelda, but yeah, Machu. And, 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 and the speed at which Rob can throw the aerials, you know, going for that fair and then immediately going into an up air when he sees where Furious is going. We saw that the strong hit Zelda Warrior from across stage. Uh, yeah. It almost killed. <laughs> move strong. Yeah, it is. But I mean, it's good positioning by Machu to know that if he's going to get hit by a move like that, he's on the right side. Not going to die to it yet. And just prolonging his life here. <laughs> Double back air there. Not going to connect, but frightening stuff. Ooh, going for that raw up smash there, trying to roll back into the uh, into nearer center stage, but doesn't come off. Down throw. See that time he went for the mash, yeah. yeah. <laughs> went for the immediate one. And Machu also ready for Ooh, what a setup with the gyro there. I was gonna say Machu also ready for Zelda trying to up air through the stage. Just has that shield out. And I mean this is uh, This would be a hell of a comeback. This Let's say that. <laughs> Over. That down air could have made it, it, it over. It, it would help if that stock, if Machu loses that stock soon. Yes. Well, goes. you gotta get one, yeah. right? You gotta start yeah. somewhere. All it oh. takes is a momentum shift, and there you go. There okay, hundred yeah. <laughs> percent. So soon, if he gets grabbed underneath the platform, it's a guarantee to kill with up throw. He is able to capitalize, yeah, on that with side lead. I mean, I'm Do cheering for it. <laughs> I want to see it. Oh, that's it. And there you have it, folks. Congratulations to Machu. Goes to losers, gets beaten by Furious in winner's final, but works his way back and a pretty solid, convincing win in grand finals. My name's Taima. This is MJ. Thank you so much for, to, for listening to us on comms today. And congratulations again to Machu for winning Stitch Face number three. All right, see ya. Yeah, that's what I mean.